Hi, I'm Whitney Brown. I'm uh, with Amnesty International, and I want to talk today a little bit about the Millennium Development Goals. The Millennium Development Goals are eight goals that countries have committed themselves to meeting by the year 2015. Now, there's a really interesting critique of the goals because they were not developed with human rights being integrated into the goals, and in fact, many of the goals are actually set at a lower standard than states have already obligated themselves to meet through their ratification of different human rights treaties. But what I want to talk about today is how important it is that we work to integrate human rights into the goals and how failure to do that means that the goals will not be met. And specifically, I want to talk about how, for instance, in the goals on things like women's empowerment or maternal health, is not going to be met unless they are willing to look at issues like violence against women as an obstacle to the achievement of those goals. So, in a nutshell, the, human, the, develop, the Millennium Development Goals need to be analyzed through a human rights framework. You need to understand why women are disempowered. You have to understand why so many women suffer from uh, poor maternal health. And once you do that analysis, what that brings you to is human rights. And what we need to say is that governments need to analyze, using a human rights framework, the obstacles to the achievement of those goals. And then they need to look at human rights as actually a tool for actually achieving them. So for instance, improved maternal health means education, water, it means reducing violence, it means stopping early marriage. That would be an example. But also in the reporting, it's really important that they integrate human rights into the reporting. Otherwise, what may happen, and in fact what we're somewhat seeing happening, is things are getting better for a certain group of women, but another group of women are actually being left even farther behind. So when they report, they need to do it by doing disaggregated reporting so that you can see are indigenous women being neglected while, say, a certain group of women are, are experiencing real advances. We want the real advances to happen, but what we don't want is for women to be left behind because they're from a marginalized group or in some ways unable to participate in the process of achieving the Millennium Development um, Goals. If you're interested in the Millennium Development Goals, um, I would suggest that you look for uh, the Millennium Development Goal website um, run by the UN, and it will give you an idea of what the goals are. But probably the best paper is a WHO paper, World Health Organization paper, on um, violence against women and the Millennium Development Goals, which can be found on the WHO website.